Okay, I'm on page 193 and I'm doing activity 1.01 .01. and the first thing it says to do is make sure that I have the hide show button turned on and it is and make sure I have the ruler showing which it is if it was not visible I would go to the view tab here and this is where you turn the ruler off and on okay now we are supposed to type uh, rock climbing 101. Press enter twice and then type increase your And it looks like I misspelled gymnasium up here, so we'll go fix that. Okay. Press enter once. Go to the insert tab. And we're going to insert text from a file and that is over here under objects text from file and then you're going to have to find this wherever it is on your computer system chapter one and I want the fitness flyer click on insert and there's my data it looks pretty much like figure 1.1 or 1.4 now on page 194 and I want to save this so let's go to the save button up here or we can go to the file menu and do save as and I want to call it, save it with my last name followed by my first name and the place I want to save it in is I've got a folder here for my stuff go ahead and save it and that takes care of that. And now I'm on objective two, insert and format graphics. So what I want to do is I want to select the first paragraph up here called Rock Climbing 101 and on the home tab in the font group I want to choose text effects and the one I want is uh, in the first row in the first row I want to go to the second one let's try that again and it's none outline accent two. they've all got names click on that and I want to make that 60 instead of 11 60 is not an option so I'm gonna to have to type it in from the keyboard and I want to center it which makes a real small change. It was almost centered the way it was. And with the text still selected in the font group, click the text effects button, point to shadow, and then under outer, in the second row, I want to click the third one. That would be this one right here. And with the text, Okay, now it should quit bugging me. Let's go back to the document I want to be on. And with text still selected in the font group, click the font color. And under theme colors in the fourth column, click the first color. So let's go to font. And I want the fourth column. The first one should say dark blue text too, and it does. and it says click anywhere in the document to deselect the text I'll click down here save your document we'll do a quick save up here and activity 1.03 inserting and resizing pictures 
uh, in the paragraph that begins increase your fitness click to position the insertion point at the beginning of the paragraph and I'm going to insert in the illustrations group I want to insert a picture and I want to find uh, the rock climber picture so that's going to be in my SkyDrive folder and there's my rock climbing picture click on insert and okay see if we need to resize it um, I want the bottom of it to be approximately at the four inch mark on the vertical ruler and it looks like I got it way too big so let's grab the corner here and resize it and that's uh, that looks pretty close and okay and then right away they tell us to undo this um, find my reset picture okay and in the size group uh, I want to make it four and a half inches tall so I've got the picture selected I see the handles around it I go to the format tab up here and over on the right side I've got height and width and I want the height to be 4.5 and right now oops, 4.5 and I want to wrap the text around the picture so make sure my picture is selected it'll give me my picture tools and, and the format tab up here and um, I want to use the wrap text button over here which controls how the text uh, wraps itself around the picture and I want square so it uh, looks pretty much like it does in the book now and uh, moving a picture uh, we're going to drag the picture to the right until the edge of the picture is approximately even with the right margin over there and okay if necessary use the arrow keys to nudge it but I think it looks pretty good the way it is and 1.06 apply picture styles and artistic effects okay keep the picture selected and on the format tab in the picture styles group would be right here point to soft edges uh, wait a second in the picture styles group click the picture effects button okay and now click soft edges and what we want is uh, a five point soft edge around it like that on the format tab in the adjust group Okay, here's the adjust group over here on the left. Click the artistic effects button and um, point to but not, do not click the third effect. And it should give us a live preview here. In the second row of the gallery, click the third effect paint brush. That would be this one right here. And if you pause, the label comes up telling you that you got the right one. Click on that and now it does a paintbrush effect on our picture and we're going to stop this video right there that's about halfway through uh, the first activity in chapter one